the only way is down from here. I was like, oh, that uncle braises. Mm. Shut up, dummy. Buy lent that fit you. Damn. Greedy. You know that I'm greedy for love. You know that I'm greedy for brown jackets. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is me, Dami. If you know me, you know me. If you don't, you don't. Hi. Uh, today I'm going to be doing a haul. Woo! Wow, so creative, Dami. I know, I know, I know. I'm a visionary of the future. But today I'm going to be doing a haul. I actually, this month I wasn't supposed to spend any money. I wasn't supposed to do any online shopping, but here we are. I don't know how we got here. I just kept forgetting, like, they'll do a promotion. Honestly, I'm a company's best dream because I'll see a promotion and I'll be like yeah maybe I do need something from there but uh, I only I say only I only bought from one two three four five places that's not <laughs> what's wrong with me I've tried most of it on already I've had it for quite a while now but except for one thing that came today so it'll be a first impression unboxing uh, I'm also going to make this quick because I know I speak too much in my Hauls. Nobody cares about my life. So let's let's get into it, shall we? Before we get into this video, please like, subscribe, comment, because please, it will make my day. I make fashion. I don't know what I make. I make hauls. I make random videos because my name is randomly Dami. I also sometimes do some beauty. I did a I don't know. I do videos. Please subscribe if you like watching YouTube videos. If you don't, then why are you on YouTube? Hmm? If not, subscribe. A uh, first place, a H&M. Okay, so me and H&M have a love-hate relationship. I don't like them, but they do have good basics and they seem to last a while. So I still end up buying from them and they were do and they don't do like, and they don't, oh my day is my hair. If it's going to be messy, it all needs to be messy. Not just one bit, like damn. H&M, they don't really do like discounts. They don't do student discount or anything. So they have a point system and that's what happened. Oh, here we go. Okay. So they have a, <laughs> me. I'm not going to speak in this video. I actually only have 20 minutes for this whole thing. Anyways, they have a members thing. I remember they did like 10% off if you become a member in store. So I did that one day, got 10% off. Didn't realize I had three pounds worth of points. So then they were like, your points are expiring. And I was like, oh, I should make an order. So then I was about to make an order. And I was like, let me just wait. I just couldn't be bothered because I had like a month left until the points expired. And then they did 20% off for students. And I was like, I can still claim that even though I am not a student. Shut up. Long story short, the points expired, but I got 20% off. So yay. Okay, so this was the thing that I... <laughs> <laughs> really appetizing. This was the thing that I got from, I kept getting ads for. It's this twill jacket. It's open. Um, it's kind of thin. I thought this would be like nice under hoodies and stuff uh, for the autumn months. And I do like it, but I feel there's something off about it. So I might not keep it. And also actually I'm not keeping it because it's half price right now. I checked it, it was in the sale. So I need to get on that, I need to rebuy it and return this one, as a matter of fact. So, it's half price now. How much was it? I don't know. All prices will be on the screen and I'll link everything below. And then, to be basic, like every other person, I bought a jacket. I love jackets, I've always loved jackets. But I got another one. I think I saw Freya Killen have this, but I'm not completely sure. But I've seen people, when I've been at work, I've seen people wear this, who are customers, and I'm like, ooh. So I bought a basic piece, but here we are. Uh, so it's actually just a flannel shirt. And it's, what color is this? Gray, <laughs> gray and white, uh, cream. And I like it. The only thing is the arms are a bit like snug. Everything else is like large, um, but the arms are snug. So I'm not too sure about wearing a jumper. See, like the jumper, it would fit, but. Well, this is probably not the best way to show it. It probably would fit, actually. I was going to size up, because this is an XL, and I was going to get a double XL, but I was like, that's just excessive. So yeah, nice. Next up, I got some, what are these? These are jeans. Uh, I don't like these jeans. They're going back, 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 back to the start. Whoa. Anyway, uh, these are straight leg, high waist, ankle life jeans, because my current black um, 
straight leg jeans which I always wear. I feel like they're gonna break sometime soon and I don't want that to happen. So these, they're wash black and there's like no not really much distressing at the bottom but they're tight and they're short they go up to my calves so i'm not keeping them and i was i thought about it but i was like let me not stress myself out so that's going back anyways then i also got this so this is a oh well I forgot how nice this was a like fluffy white jumper it's got like a collar open collar no buttons and yeah i quite like it i thought i should quite like it i did spend money on it this is in a large and yeah it's fluffy it's white it's nice it's quite it's if you want it to be tight go down the size because that's like it's kind of still big even though it's my regular size so i got this black top this makes me feel sophisticated when i wore this top what's going on here it's like a one of those slash I don't know, you'll see it in the picture. It's like a black top and the neck is not right. Uh, I feel like a woman. <laughs> I feel like a woman when I put this on. I like wore it and I wore it with the thing I'm gonna show you next and I was like, wow, I could go for like <laughs> drinks. <laughs> but I'm not leaving the house. Anyway, next. Stay with your regular size with that one. Anyway, now I've got this some leather trousers so i got these leather trousers i kept getting asked for this as well and um, they're straight leg i do i really like them but they're just too short i'm just too tall for the grind of h&m uh yeah they're just too short and um, the thighs were a bit tight but i was like i can squeeze but i shouldn't squeeze i should just get my money back so yes, uh, next up, oh gosh, flying through. Next I went to Urban Outfitters. I don't know why, I think they also did 20% off. And, oh no, 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 I actually have a reason why I bought this. Okay, so there's a TikTok and it's the one where it goes, it's Friday night, we ain't kicking it a while on a Friday night. We just found this pot on this Friday night. Go, you probably right, let me look in your closet, see what I can win. Set the one you got, let me see what I can spend. That one. Um, there was this one and this girl, I was mesmerised, <laughs> I don't know what it was but I was like wow I need that top when she was like, when they got dressed to go out and it's this top, it is, let me sort it out, so it's this top and, sh and somebody said the name of it in the comments, I wanted to cry, so <laughs> it honestly it doesn't look like it looks on her on me but I still like it, it's okay, it's okay. It's just like this brown geo thing, it's from the Eats France line. It's kind of expensive though, so I might still return it or... I'm only going to keep one thing from Urban because it's too expensive. No, But yeah, it's just that. Cool. I don't know how much it was, £29 it said, but I think they were having 20% off, so that's why I bought it. Then, this is inside out. I got this as a layering piece. It's this green um, t-shirt. What? Long sleeve? I actually have a top just like this. I probably should just return it. But it's got poppers uh, at the front bit there, and it's like got the seams overlock seams this is kind of what i wanted to go for with my skirt video Woo! where i did a skirt transformation turned two t-shirts into a skirt and i was supposed to make a top into a shirt and i was going to make it into like this but a vest but i never got around to it because i am lazy so i'm probably going to return that because i only have something like that then i got some jeans these are inside out i've not worn these i just took them off I just shoot them in a bag. So these are from the BDG thing. I've never bought from there because they never have my size lol at a price that I want to pay. So these are the jeans. They're blue light wash. I feel like you can wear blue jeans in winter. Just wear leather jacket. If you want to see my Pinterest video, I did just that. Anyway, uh, there's distressed on the knee and at the bottom as well and then fun fact there's distress on the butt however it doesn't lead to your bum bum so nobody can amazing amazing these are on the sale as well and i still got 20 percent off so i might keep these because they should be 55 and then i got them for 30. they are a tiny bit short but nothing i can't work with nothing like if i wear it with boots or trainers it won't look too bad with i feel like i'm Oh, I can go through something right now. I don't know what. 
yeah that's it cool now we go on to ego Woo. so i went to ego obviously did not go there but uh they had i got an email and it was like the only main collection is here and i was like okay i'm not buying any shoes so i thought but they were also having 20 percent off so i was just like let me look see if there's anything there but i also i wanted to get these slippers which you're gonna see because lily melrose has them and she was raised about them so i was like oh i'm gonna get them okay so look, the first thing i got this is apparently from the molly may collection are two bags they're like these patchwork bags like this i like them but mm, this has grown on me since the last time i've seen it this just got a strap like this it's supposed to be like the bottega veneta i can't say the word bags and you can like extend it a bit longer not much longer actually it can just really go shorter the only way is down from here and can wear it crossbody or maybe there's more to no that's it yeah i think i got it in black and i also got it in white as well i prefer the white one so i'm just i was only going to keep one so i'm going to keep the white one because a i don't have any white bags and b i feel like the white one looks not more expensive but more expensive this one you can kind of tell it's cheap it looks better now that i'm seeing it a second time so maybe i will keep it well actually why would i keep both where am i going nowhere so cool beans. so these are these are the slippers they're like brown they're like the ugg fluffier slippers and they've got the elastic however i got i'm a half size so i got these in the size up and my, my feet are my toes hang off <laughs> I'm on the edge of glory so and also they're very like grippy at the bottom but when your foot's in there they slip around a lot so I feel like I would break my face if I ran down the stairs in these okay let me tell you how like you're probably the most dangerous fucking shoe to have on planet earth where's the heels bro first of all the ankle the strap ratio is just horrendous bitch I need support on my ankles bitch what the fuck damn it it's been multiple times the public I ain't gonna eat So I'm going to return them because, and they're not that comfortable to be completely honest. They're just, they're very sturdy, but not for me, really. Oh, wow, Lost Brand, PLT. I was watching a Sarah Ashcroft, Ashcroft video and I've literally watched four of her hauls in my life. And as soon as I watched the most recent one, a PLT haul, I was like, I need to buy two of the things in this. So that ad was very well done. Oh my gosh, I'm out of breath. So this just arrived today. I'm probably going to do a... I'm going to come back when I'm wearing these clothes to tell you what I think. Okay, so I got these jeans. I got these in a 16 and a 14. See which one's best. They're just straight mom jeans. And they've got a zip at the front. I would never wear them unzipped, I don't think. But the zip is grey, so that's good. It kind of just blends in. Just looks like a seam, a fun seam. So, yeah, and they've got a line all the way down the end. Um, she did, Sarah Afkoff did not tell me to buy these. But I saw them and I thought, hmm, I may as well try it. Okay, so these are the size 14 in these jeans. Okay. These aren't even from the long section, but they, like, are bunching up at the bottom. Uh, they're also a bit, they fit around the waist pretty nice, but the thigh they're a bit tight, you know, I mean, like the squat isn't all the way there, but let me try the 16 on, <laughs> because in the, because in the um, product picture, they had it on weirdly and I did not like it, it looked, a bit, I did not like it, I don't like it one bit, uh, but then when I looked at like the other colour, the blue, they fit the model normally so i'm not i don't want to wear my jeans like that pretty little thing i don't want to do it i don't want to do it okay so these are the 16 in these um obviously don't fit the best the waist is waist on thinner uh, no uh the waist is a bit bigger uh there is more room on the thighs i can more room for activities so that's always good uh they got, i don't know if i want to keep them or not let me look in there i do kind of like them because i feel like these are just like a good 
kind of straight baggy leg jean and then they've got this zip at the bottom really bringing me back to uh, 2012 when I used to wear grey jeggings <laughs> with a zip on them from Primark I don't know why I would walk around with just the front of my like ankle showing but I might keep these let me know should I keep them should I not because I don't really have any black jeans that go like full length they're all cropped for some unknown reason the unknown reason is I don't know when to say no when the jean length is incorrect on me I just like mm, they're ankle bruises mm. shut up dummy buy length that fit you damn this is one thing Sarah Cross did make me buy she made me do it she held me at gunpoint for a video so this is a leather blazer okay I'm just listening to myself say this I'm ridiculous why the hell did I buy a leather cropped blazer anyway I did it's brown very creased okay PLT but she got it's from the curve range so she was a size 8 and she got a 16 so I got a 20 because I didn't want to get size 24 I couldn't do that or else I might have cried myself to sleep that night but yeah it looks we'll try it on we'll try it on I don't know what to say about that Okay, this is the brown jacket. Don't mind the t-shirt, it's not iron, but well, that's not my problem, is it? So, um, in theory, I don't look like Sarah Ashcroft right now. Uh, I don't really like it. It could be because it's so creased, but yeah, I don't need this. I'm just, I also remembered I do already own a cropped brown blazer. So this was just me being greedy, basically. Greedy! You know that I'm greedy for love. You know that I'm greedy for brown jackets. Oh, also, the buttons do in fact work. So, if you are inclined to buy this, this is what you can look like. Then this was another thing she told me to buy. Forced me, should I say. They're these brown trousers. I really like them. Oh, I hope they fit. They only had one size left, size 14. And I was like, ugh. I want to try 16 as well, but I'll just bite the bullet. I can return them. So they're these brown mocha. Just like me. <laughs> oh, no, it's not like me. Oh, is it? I don't know. Uh, wrong undertones. And they're like a suit trouser with a pin tuck in the middle. And elasticated bead. Uh, and pockets. And she wore this, that brown jacket, and a white top. And I thought it looked really nice. So there we go. Okay, so these are the brown trousers. Uh, I do really like them actually. They're long enough for me. Good. Let me walk on over here. You'll see that. Let me stand on here. You'll see that. <laughs> Only thing is, they are a bit tight just here. But other than that, they're fine. And the elastic is tight, so I'm thinking I might just try and size up and wait until they uh, really release. <laughs> it's not exclusive, is it? Wait until they like. Uh, restock a 16 in these because oh there's pockets as well amazing because I feel like I'll be more comfortable but then I'm like is that motivation but then I'm also like why should I waste money on motivation when I can just get something that fits me now but I do like them I just keep them anyway because I don't think they look that bad and they're not like uncomfortable because they're nice and stretchy. I also remembered I already have a pair of trousers. They're so comfortable. They like lounging trousers. Anyway, I already have a pair of trousers like this, but they're bright pink. And they're not elastic. There's like a zip. So when I put them on, I was like, these feel, feel familiar. And it's because I already have trousers with the same pin tuck in the middle and from Pretty Alty. But they're bright pink. And I just need a white hoodie to wear them with. But I can't seem to find a white hoodie. So. I also got these jeans. These are tall jeans. I realised I need to stop buying regular people jeans. Because my legs are too long. They try to put me on the cover. But anyway. So I got two of these. I got two different colours. And I got one in 16, one in 14. These are the 16. And they're like light blue. And hopefully they're long. So they cover like my jeans and they don't look like jack ups like the jeans I'm wearing right now. And I got the same jeans but in a darker blue as well. Okay. Ooh. Squeeze into these big 
I was gonna say bad boys, but I said big boys. The bad boys always a lemon. Anyway, so these are a great length on me for jeans, boots. Can y'all see the length? Y'all see the length? Uh, but they are just tight for no good reason in the thigh area. Like, whew. Like, you know, sometimes when you wear jeans, like, if you move, you just go straight back to where you were because they're just pushing you back in. Same with these. So let's see my range of motion. Yeah. Oh gosh, that's, that's barely any. How am I going to sit down? Let me try and sit down. <sighs> okay. It's a falling down situation. <laughs> these are the 16. So I'm not even going to bother to try on the 14 because I don't want to cry today, so... <laughs> What's this? Oh, I got these uh, leggings. Once again, Lily Melrose made me do it. And they're disco leggings. Okay, she didn't make me do this. <laughs> she has the ASOS ones, but I wasn't making an ASOS order, was I? Uh, we'll try that on. She says that she likes them more than just regular leggings because... I don't know. I don't know how they did it, but PLT managed to ruin leggings. And you might be like, Danny, what's wrong with them? Look at this ankle. Why is it, why is the ankle baggy? Their leggings just make them tight like the rest of it. And, oh God. And you can't even go up a size because then it'll be even worse. Wow. Well, down a size because then it'll just be like excessively tight for what underwear. Maybe I should just, Maybe I should bite the bullet and spend the extra four pounds on the ASOS ones. <sighs> Tragic. Are they see-through? Yeah, they are. Look at that. But last thing in the haul, wow, guys. I just got this cropped uh, white jumper with a roll neck. Uh, for the winter season, I'm like layering. So I thought I could wear this under that blazer with jeans, anything. I could wear it to work if I really wanted to. Okay, so this is the white jumper. Um, I feel like I don't. The roll neck's a bit weird. I don't know. There's something about it. There's something about. Let me turn the window. It's ripped. Yeah. Uh, I feel like the. It's getting a squat. I feel like the turtle neck's a bit weird. I think it's also because I've got a short neck. Not really got much of a neck to me. So, but other than that, I kind of like it. Yeah, I'm not going to keep it. That's everything, guys. World record haul from Dami. Oh my days. I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> Thank you for watching this video. Please like, subscribe, comment down below. Do you like any of these items? Did I persuade you? Did I do a set of Afrikaans on you? Just bah, made you buy it. But yeah, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and have a nice day. Mm.